Hey guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. This is Daniel Rosal here. I want to talk today about using camcorders if, like me, you wear uh, spectacles, you use glasses. So obviously you can use a camcorder, but there's a couple of uh, things to know. So the one I'm, um, the camcorder I'm using, I picked this up a few weeks ago, it's the uh, Canon XA40 professional camcorder. So this is a pretty typical camcorder in that it has a classic viewfinder. This is called an OLED viewfinder, not OLCD, OLED. And this guy pops out like this. And you've also got your flip out LCD to screen, uh, LCD screen that can be very usefully inverted. So if you're actually recording yourself and when you turn it around, um, it actually changes rotation, which is really useful as well. So if you're trying to use this to vlog, which can be done, um, you can just look straight into the screen and see yourself. So if you are wearing spectacles, um, Obviously looking through the LCD screen is no problem, but one thing, to, a couple of things to know about. Firstly, if you're in bright weather, it can be very difficult to see the LCD screen. Now, typically uh, camcorders do have in the settings menu, a setting for adjusting the backlight brightness of the LCD screen. So you can crank that up uh, to maximum if you're shooting in bright conditions. The second thing you can use is one of these uh, sunscreens. So these guys literally, this is a Velcro thing I picked up from Amazon for about 15 bucks. And uh, what this guy does is it just wraps around, you literally wrap it around the LCD screen and then uh, just connect the Velcro. This is not done very well, but just to kind of demonstrate the idea. And now you've got yourself a little uh, tunnel um, through which if it's really bright outside, you can look into that and uh, you'll be able to see the screen much easier. Now the OLED viewfinder is the thing I really wanted to talk about. So this is this guy that just pops out, you pull it out and it can be toggled up to, locks off at about 45 degrees. So you can look into it like this, or you can look into it uh, when it's on the level like this. Now, yeah, you do look a little bit ridiculous. Now you might be wondering how does this work with glasses? So to take this camcorder as an example, I'm gonna turn it on and gonna open the lens hood and I'm going to look through uh, the screen here. You need to turn off the LCD. So if you have glasses, you're gonna be pressing up against your, the glasses of your glasses against the glass of this. It's not the most comfortable. So I would say if you wear contact lenses, um, I used to wear contacts for many years and then my eyes just kind of stopped being able to tolerate them, but it's more comfortable, but it definitely can be done. It's just, you know, your glasses are gonna be pushing up against the rubber. You might find that a little bit uncomfortable. Um, but another really important thing to note is that at least on this uh, camcorder, the Canon XA40, there's this little flip switch here. And what this does is adjust the diopter. So if you wear glasses or contacts, you probably come across this word diopter before. Basically it's the strength of the, um, the power of the lens, right? So you have two options. One, you can use it with glasses. And for that, I didn't adjust the diopter at all. So in other words, it's not there. It's, it's the, the lens is just um, a tunnel basically, right? There's no magnification, there's no power in the lens. What I can do is this. If I take off my glasses, wow, I'm really, really blind. I'm like minus 7.5. So if I look into the viewfinder now, everything is super, super blurry. But what I can do is adjust the diopter. And there we go. And now when I've adjusted it fully, so I guess I am as, my optic as can be that I have to adjust it all the way. Um, but that basically brings power to the lens of the OLED viewfinder. Uh, so that's an option as well. So you can do one of two things and it's probably best because now that I have my glasses back on, the viewfinder looks all wrong because I've set it for myself not wearing glasses. So it's probably better to just decide what works for you, set the diopter accordingly. And on my cam camcorder, the Canon XA40, it's literally just a switch here. It's super easy to move with one finger. Uh, so set it up accordingly and then you'll be good to go. Um, so it's a question of whether you wanna pop your glasses back on and back off when you're using the viewfinder or whether you just wanna configure it so that um, it's good to go with your glasses on. I'd probably go for the latter unless I was using it for a really long period of time, in which case uh, the pushing my glasses up against my face might become a bit uncomfortable. So um, you can definitely use a, camcor a camcorder if you are uh, bespeckled uh, like myself. Um, a couple of things that might be useful is uh, if you have a diopter switch 
um, on your OLED lens filter, OLED viewfinder, and in general, those are very useful things. If your camcorder just has an LCD screen um, and you live somewhere sunny, I live in Israel, so it's really sunny for two thirds of the year. It's really worth picking up uh, one of these little sun visor hoods. You just need to know the uh, width of your LCD screen and then find one either for your camcorder or that'll work for, um, for that width. And then it just basically creates a little tunnel for you that you can look into um, and it kind of replicates the job of the viewfinder as such, but uh, just using a little bit of uh, gear that you can just uh, fold away and put back in your camera bag when you're done with it. Hope that video was useful and if you'd like to get more videos from me, please subscribe to this YouTube channel.